Hi, my name is Matt. Welcome back to the shop. And um, this is a little extra part to do with the Easy Engine. So I've been releasing all the videos over God knows how many months now, and um, I want to kind of get people involved to a certain degree. And I have loads and loads to do, not just with the Easy Engine, but with all the other projects and stuff for the channel that I do in general. And I just thought I'd try and open it up so people can have a, uh, well, open up a discussion, but also just so people can have a stab at it and kind of like, you know, add into the whole thing. So one of the things that I um, am handing out to you guys is uh, the ignition system. So it's not because I'm just sat here going, do you know what, other people can deal with it, I can't be bothered. Um, I just thought that this would be a good uh, project for people to get involved in. So I have a picture here of, uh, is it Jan, Jan Riders, which was a dude on the model engineering or model engine website, and he made a um, blocker, uh, which is a, um, you know, like a, a gas fire igniter. Um, and here's a picture of that. It's basically, like I say, it's just a flame gun thing that has a um, butane canister in there, just basically like a cigarette lighter. Um, but it uses this circuit board, which has a coil in it and um, a uh, metal thin film capacitor and some bits and pieces, an oscillator, and that's the way that it does it in a sense. Um, I'll show you a drawing at the end, but I'll also put the description to his site because he goes through a massive explanation of why he chose to do this and what modifications by basically upping the capacitance and so on and so forth and isolating one or two things and pretty much just removing the oscillator. Um, one of the other options that I came up with was to buy one of these and this is basically a coil, uh, step-up coil for, I think they're from eBay, they're like four quid got a few of them just to mess around with and test and I think it's used for a taser or something like that it's an eBay piece of shit and it's all potted you can't get inside and it's not really nice so what I want to do on oh, the last other picture before I jump on to what I want to do is there's the difference between the um, gas lighter you know the cigarette lighter thingy and the actual coil that I got off eBay um, and here's the drawing that uh, Jan did on his website or on the page of the website of what he actually did, uh, which is very nicely done, I must say. But what I want to say to you guys is if you, you know, you like your electronics and stuff, I don't mind doing it, but if you guys want to come up with your own idea of how we can have around about 10 to 15 kV um, at the actual spark plug, um, from a 1.5 volt supply, from a 6 volt or a 9 volt, something like that, doesn't have to be crazy. Um, if you come up, even, even if you come up with a drawing of what resistors and what have you, then I'll buy all the bits and I'll build it. I'll even build if two or three people come out with different ideas. I'll build each one because the you know the parts are chicken parts. You know the um, thin film capacitors and resistors and diodes and MOSFETs and all this rest of it. They're not really expensive, um, but if you come up with all the parts. If you basically give me all the part numbers, I will buy them and I'll build them. And we will test them all and see which one um, can discharge the fastest. We'll see how fast how what they are. We'll see how fast we can get this engine to go in relation to RPM. And obviously because it's a two-stroke, it has to fire every time it gets to TDC. Um, the micro switch and all the rest of it really isn't a problem. Um, you can just label where that goes and I'll pick a micro switch to actually um, fire the plug and then I'll work out all the advance or retarding that we have to do to make sure we get good clean combustion. Any road, so I'm going to leave you with the um, page that Jan did and there'll be a link in the description to that. So if you have any ideas, um, or not ideas, well you can have ideas, I don't know what the fuck I'm on talking about. <laughs> Basically, if you want to do this, you want to get involved, draw up your idea, send me a picture of it, send me a copy of it, send me whatever, and you'll be fully accredited with it as being your idea and what have you, and then I will build it, and then we'll test it out. 
So, uh, like I say, it's just a bit of um, community engagement, you know, so you can all kind of have a stab at it and stuff like that. Hope that all makes sense, and I'll see you in a bit.